And let me tell you what went into this report. There were 19 lawyers employed, approximately 40 FBI agents, intel analysts, forensic, forensic accountants, and other staff, 2,800 subpoenas issued, 500 witnesses interviewed, 500 search warrants executed, more than 230 orders for communication records so they records could be obtained, 13 requests to foreign governments for evidence, over $25 million spent over two years. We may not agree on much, but I hope we can agree that he had ample resources, took a lot of time, and talked to a lot of people. And you can read for yourself what he found. The Attorney General will tell us a bit about what his opinion of the report is. In terms of interacting with the White House, the White House turned over to Mr. Mueller 1.4 million documents and records, never asserted executive privilege one time, over 20 White House staffers, including eight from the White House Counsel's Office, were interviewed voluntarily. Don McGahn, Chief Counsel for the White House, was interviewed for over 30 hours. Everybody that they wanted to talk to from the Trump campaign on the ground, they were able to talk to. The President submitted himself to written interrogatories. So to the American people, Mr. Mueller was the right guy to do this job. I always believed that Attorney General Sessions was conflicted out because he was part of the campaign. He was the right guy with ample resources and the cooperation he needed to find out what happened was given in my view.